How's this sound? No pain after knee replacement surgery. It's not too good to be true. Dr. Maria Simbra explains how orthopedic surgeons are taking pain out of the equation by using something that's been around for years at your dentist's office. Cindy McCoy's knees were worn out. I was falling constantly. I probably fell four or five times at work. She tried various injections, but the damage was too severe. It looked like shredded lobster. You really are a serious candidate for a full knee. You're a bone on bone. But she hesitated because she was afraid. The pain, big baby I am, so that was the thing. Her surgeon was trying something new to minimize the pain after surgery, but two weeks before the operation. It's a shot, but not steroids or a gel or chicken goo, and not into the joint space. We do a series of injections above and below their knee. It takes about 20 minutes um, where we inject the, the nitrous oxide into the area around where the nerves run. Uh, it freezes the outside of those nerves. Uh, it causes them to have to regenerate, which can take two to three months. And while they're regenerating, theoretically, they shouldn't be able to transmit as much nerve pain. The injections are called Iovera. It would cut down on the, the pain, cut down on how long you would do the pain medication and recovery time. Tiny compressed cartridges of nitrous oxide or laughing gas like at the dentist office cool the nerves to minus 80 degrees. It just kind of sits there in the tissue and, and to freeze them. They start out um, watching the ultrasound and finding your nerves. They do a series uh, at the top of your knee and a series down the side. No numbness, no weakness, no stay in the hospital. Patients can walk afterwards. When I saw the three prongs coming up, I'm like, ooh, that's going to hurt going in there. Uh, but all you really felt was pressure. Like, you didn't feel any pain and all that. Cindy wasn't sure the injections would do anything, but when she woke up... I knew that I had surgery, but it wasn't anything that I needed to say, I need a pain pill right now. And I thought it would hurt really bad because they have you walk on it right away. It hurt, but not enough to stop me. She was so impressed, she asked for it for the other knee. I says, of course, we're doing the eye of air, right? This time, she wasn't scared to proceed. If I would not have had it for my, my first one, I probably wouldn't have done the second one. The biggest downside is it, it, it may not work, but I would rate our effectiveness over 90%. It is FDA approved and covered by insurance. The patients are usually pretty happy. The hardest thing is to get up because both your knees are taking all that weight. The steps were easy. Now I can run around out back with my grandkids instead of worrying about falling. Cindy feels lucky. I'm not sure that there's a lot of doctors around this area that do the Ayavera. I'm so glad that I did it. She's had both knees replaced and she has exceeded expectations with her rehab. I'm Dr. Maria Sumbra, KDKA News.